Hello, I'm Gus. And I'm Blue. Welcome to our YouTube channel. We're going to be showing you some of our techniques and demonstrating some of our work for you. Don't forget to press like and subscribe. Hello, I'm Gus Scott and we're in Kunsthof Scott Moser studio where we work and I'm talking about my paintings and this little painting is um, about mowers and some ancient rock carving or drawings from New Zealand and I've used the symbols in this painting and the moa, of course, was it's extinct and it was the largest bird ever known, a very heavy flightless bird, which was basically eaten to extinction, being so tasty and having such large legs. And there was a few varieties of this, this bird and many skeletons and fossil remains were found um, because it didn't become extinct until 1500, 2000 years, not very long ago, um, probably much later. They just didn't find them in the, in the forests in New Zealand. Anyway, the interesting thing about this position of time is that when these birds were roaming around in New Zealand, there were, of course, there were, there were native people, the, the Maori people were there um, in small numbers. And in Europe, of course, it would have been, say, um, we had the, these rock drawings. Uh, they're not sure how, how old they are, but that is a symbol used and found in, in these caves in New Zealand and there's a symbol here which is a, an Elizabethan symbol from Europe created by a chap called John Dee. Now he was an Elizabethan magus and a mathematician and generally regarded as some sort of wizard and astrologer and main scientific kind of guy in the court of Elizabeth I in, in England. And um, he used a monad, which is this symbol here, which is an, a conglomeration of all the known planets at the time, all their symbols in one. And um, he presented that to Queen Elizabeth. As, as a token of his faith, etc. But the thing is that at the time of Elizabethan England, um, it's quite likely that there were still mowers in, in New Zealand, very few people and lots of birds. In, in another painting up there, um, there's a mower with a with a symbol that was also found in uh, caves and it represents a, a huge eagle, which is also extinct. And so the, the giant mower had a giant um, bird after it, a bird of prey, which was is called Haast's eagle because it was discovered by Haast um, in the 1800s. And so that symbol is in these Maori carving, or not carvings, they're cave drawings. And um, it represents the eagle which could attack the moa, a giant bird. And so I've played with the um, time span here where we're thinking about what was happening in Europe and what was happening in England in, in the 1500s and earlier and 
what was happening in New Zealand was basically birds were living there and um, I have a great interest in, in birds and Elizabethan times. <laughs>